Math's topic today is about this equation, P equals R times B, where P is your percent and then R is ratio in terms of this symbol. And then B stands for base. Okay, example number one. Blank percent of 72 is equal to 9. So we have to write the given before we solve this number one. So what are the given? So as what I said, if there is a symbol of percent, it means this is your R. So this is the unknown. And then 72 is your base. And then this is your P. Because from the formula, P equals R times B. So this will be P is equal to 9. So we will use this formula, P equals R times B. Since R is unknown, so we will resolve this formula. So in terms of R, R equals P over B. So this is not the formula. So we will substitute the value of P, which is 9. And then B is 72. Since I have a fraction in here, so I need to reduce into lowest term. So I need to divide this 1 by 9, divide by 9. So 9 divided by 9, that is 1. 72 divided by 9, that is 8. Then we need to change this one to percentage because this is in terms of percent. So this will be multiplied by 100%. So, I have here 1 8 times 100%. So, I need to reduce this one by dividing by 4. 8 divided by 4 is 2. And then, 100 divided by 4 is 25. So, I have here 25% over 2. So, what is 25 divided by 2? 25 divided by 2. So, 25 divided by 2. So, I can use this one. So, this is 1. 1 times 2 is 2. Take away will be 0. Bring down 5. Estimate how many 2 do I have in 5? I have 2. 2 times 2 is 4. And then take away. 5 take away 4 is 1. Then I will add 0. I will put that at the top and then bring down 0. So how many 2 do I have in 10? That is 5. 5 times 2 is 10. Take away, that will be 0. So I have 12.5%. So this is now my R ratio. And then I need to check this one by uh, applying this one. Substitute the 12.5 in here. 12.5% of 72. So... 12.5% of of means times times 72 but i need to i need to convert this one into decimal so how to convert this one to decimal so 12.5% will be divided by 100 so how to divide cross out this symbol and then since i have two decimal places so I start in here and then move to decimal places because I have two zeros. Move to decimal places to the left. One, two. So I have 0.125. So I need this decimal to multiply by 72. This will be 0.125 times 72. Let us check if this will be equal to 9. So, 2 times 5 is 10, carry 1. 2 times 2 is 4, plus 1 is 5. 2 times 1 is 2. Then, 7 times 5 is 35, carry 3. 2 times 7 is 14, plus 3, 17, carry 1. 1 times 7 is 7, plus 1 is 8. Bring down 0. 5 plus 5 is 10, 0, carry 1. 1 plus 2 plus 7 is 10, carry 1. 1 plus 8 is 9. Since I have two decimal places in here, so I will start also from right to left, three decimal places. So, 1, 
2, 3. So I have 9 is equal to 9. So therefore, number 1 is correct. Now let's proceed to number 2. Number 2 is 15 is 60% of blank. So we need to write the given. So we know that 15 means equal. So this 15 is my percent. 15. And then there is a symbol of percent. So this will be R. 60%. And then of this is now my base. This is the unknown. Again, we have to apply this formula. P equals R times B. Solving for B. So B is equal to P over R. So what is now our value for P? P is 15. And then R is 60%. So how, how to write this one in decimal? 60% so divide by 100% cross out this one so cross out also the two zeros one at the top and one at the bottom so the, I have now 6 over 10 so since I have only one zero at the bottom so I need to move from right to left so one decimal place only one so this will be 0. 0.6 so this will be 0. 0.6 now, how to divide this one to find our base? So, 15 divide by 15 divide by 0. 0.6. So, we cannot divide this one because it's in terms of decimal and then this whole number. So, I need to move this one to the right and then add 0 for my dividend. So, I have now 6 and then 150. So, 150 divided by 6. So I need to use this one. 15. Estimate how many 6 are there in? 15. So this would be 2. 6 times 2 is 12. Take away 5. Take away 2. This is 3. And then bring down 0. So how many 6 are there in 30? This is 5. Then multiply. This is 30. Take away 30. That will be 0. So this is now equal to? 25. So B is equal to 25. Let us check if this is correct. How to check? Sixty percent of twenty-five. See to it that this will be equal to fifteen. If this is not equal to fifteen, meaning I am wrong. So 60% of 25. So how to convert this one in decimal? This will be 0. 0.60 or 0. 0.6. 0. 0.6, right? Times 25 is equals to 15. Let us just check. 60% divided by 100%. Cross out the symbol. Cross out 0. And then I have 6 over 10. Since I have only one zero, so I need to move backward. So one place, 0. 0.6. So this is correct, 0. 0.6. And then we multiply by 25. That will come up with 15. So let us try 25 times 0. 0.6. So this is 5 times 6 is 30. Carry 3. 2 times 6 is 12 plus 3, 15. Since I have only one decimal place, so I will start at the right, then move one decimal place, one. So this will be 15 is equal to 15. So meaning 25 is correct. That's all for number two.